रिस्पेक्टेड प्राइम मिनिस्टर श्री नरेंद्र मोदी जी ऑनरेबल मिनिस्टर श्री रविशंकर प्रसाद जी ऑनरेबल गेस्ट लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन अ वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग टू ईच एंड एवरी वन ऑफ यू इन फोर शॉर्ट इयर्स द इंडियन मोबाइल कांग्रेस हैज ग्रोन इनॉर्मसली इन प्रेस्टीज एंड इम्पैक्ट इट हैज ऑलरेडी अर्न अ प्राउड प्लेस इन द एनुअल कैलेंडर ऑफ ग्लोबल कॉन्वर्जेश ऑन डिजिटल टेक्नोलॉजीज this is because of india's two unique strengths which the world has now fully recognized one is the confluence of the three d's india's vibrant democracy india's young demography and india's digital transformation the other is the visionary and the dynamic leadership of our prime minister shri narendra modi ji respected pradhan mantri ji your digital india mission has made our country highly resilient in the face of the toughest of adversities the outbreak of covid-19 posed life threatening challenges but our high speed 4g connectivity infrastructure has proved to be india's digital lifeline throughout 2020 india worked online studied online shopped online received healthcare online socialized online played online simply put india thrived online this underscores the phenomenal evolution of digital technology in india from being a means of limited engagement and entertainment it has evolved into a platform of unlimited enablement and empowerment despite the lockdown the entire industry consisting of thousands of engineers and employees worked round the clock to provide critical support 24 by 7 to all sections of the society and business the government supported the industry to go the extra mile in keeping these critical services going during this period they deserve our appreciation and gratitude honorable prime minister with great admiration and enthusiasm the nation has welcomed your announcement about the early availability of an affordable covid vaccine the pandemic will surely be behind us soon in 2021 under your leadership india will welcome the new decade with supreme confidence the indian economy will not only bounce back but will also grow with unprecedented acceleration india can and india will prove cynex wrong by becoming a 5 trillion dollar economy it will be a more equal india with increased incomes increased employment and improved quality of life for 1 billion indians at the middle and the bottom of the economic pyramid India has the historic opportunity to become the world's preeminent digital society with ease of living for all. My conviction comes from the enormous transformative power of digital technologies. Permit me therefore to present briefly four ideas for your consideration. One, as many as 300 million mobile subscribers in India are still trapped in the 2g era urgent policy steps are needed to ensure that these underprivileged people have an affordable smartphone so that they too can benefit from direct benefit transfer into their bank accounts and actively participate in the digital economy two india is today among the best digitally connected nations in the world in order to maintain this lead policy steps are needed to accelerate early roll out of 5g and to make it affordable and available everywhere i assure you that jio will pioneer the 5g revolution in india in the second half of 2021 it will be powered by indigenous developed network hardware and technology components jio's 5g service will be a testimony 
to your inspiring vision of Atmanirbhar Bharat. Three, I can say with utmost confidence that 5G will enable India to not only participate in the fourth industrial revolution, but also to lead it. Geo Platforms, with its family of over 20 startup partners, has built world-class capabilities in artificial intelligence, cloud computing, big data and machine learning, Internet of Things, mixed and virtual reality cloud, and blockchain. We are creating compelling homegrown solutions in education, healthcare, agriculture, infrastructure, financial services, and new commerce. Each of these solutions, once proven in India, will be offered to the rest of the world to address global challenges. Four, as digitization of the Indian economy and Indian society picks up speed, the demand for digital hardware will grow enormously. We cannot rely on large-scale imports in this area of critical national need. Thanks to the Honorable Minister Sri Ravi Shankar Prasadji's efforts, many leading global companies are coming to India to set up manufacturing facilities. India has developed world-class trends in chip design. I clearly foresee India becoming a major hub for state-of-the-art semiconductor industry. When all stakeholders work together, we can surely ensure that India's success in hardware will match our success in software. Friends, we are about to step into a glorious decade of the India story with the Digital India mission playing the role of the principal accelerator. Nothing can stop India's rise, not even COVID-19. This is our chance to create history. Let us do it. Let us do it together under the leadership of our Prime Minister. I wish all of you the best of health and a happy new year in advance. Thank you.